Billy, a little boy with a magic pencil, a pencil with a special power. Anything Billy draws comes to life. Isn't that amazing? So one day, Billy decides to draw a dragon, not just any dragon, a friendly, playful dragon. As he puts the finishing touches on his sketch, the dragon leaps off the page and starts flying around. Billy is thrilled. He names his new friend Sparky. Oh, what a sight it is, a little boy and his dragon frolicking around, the best of friends in no time. Sparky with his shiny scales and Billy with his magic pencil, they make quite a pair. They laugh, they play, they share secrets. Billy and Sparky, now inseparable, ready to take on any adventure that comes their way. Their story is just beginning and it's bound to be a magical one. One sunny morning, Billy and Sparky decided to fly over the vast green forest. As they soared between the towering trees, they stumbled upon a sight that stopped them in their tracks. A group of mean-looking goblins were huddled around uh, something shiny. Upon closer inspection, they realized it was a treasure chest, and the goblins were trying to steal it from a distressed unicorn. Without missing a beat, Billy whipped out his magic pencil. With swift strokes, he sketched a glimmering sword, so real it seemed to leap off the paper. Handing the sword to Sparky, he said, Let's save that unicorn, buddy. With a determined nod, Sparky swooped down toward the goblins, brandishing the magic sword. The sight of a dragon charging at them with a gleaming sword was enough to send the goblins scurrying away in fear. The forest echoed with their panicked yells as they disappeared into the underbrush. With the goblins gone, the forest was peaceful once again. The unicorn, now free from her tormentors, approached Billy and Sparky. Her eyes were filled with gratitude and she nuzzled against them gently. In her soft, melodic voice, she thanked them for their bravery. As a token of her gratitude, she offered them a small vial filled with a glowing potion. This is a magic potion, she explained. It will grant you one wish. With the goblins gone, the unicorn was free and grateful. As a token of her gratitude, she offered Billy and Sparky a magic potion. A magic potion that grants one wish. Billy could wish for anything in the world. Imagine the possibilities. But Billy, ever the loyal friend, had only one desire in his heart. He wanted his best friend Sparky to talk. With a twinkle in his eye, Billy held the potion high and said, I wish that Sparky could talk. The words hung in the air, charged with anticipation. The unicorn, her eyes gleaming with kindness, waved her wand. A dazzling rainbow of colors burst from the wand, swirling around Sparky, and then the unexpected happened. A voice as warm and friendly as a summer's day echoed in the air. Billy, is that you? The voice was coming from Sparky. Billy's wish had come true. His dragon friend could now speak. Billy's eyes widened in surprise, his heart filled with joy. He turned to Sparky, his eyes brimming with excitement. Sparky! You can talk! The dragon replied, Yes, Billy, and I have so much to say. Sparky's voice was filled with happiness, and his words filled the air with a new kind of magic. From that moment on, their adventures became even more exciting. They could now share their thoughts, tell jokes, and have long, funny conversations. It was a dream come true for both of them. Billy and Sparky could now not only play together, but also have long, funny conversations. And so their magical journey continued, filled with laughter, friendship, and endless chatter. And with Sparky now able to talk, Billy's adventures were more fun than ever. They journeyed far and wide, from the snowy peaks of towering mountains to the sun-drenched beaches of quaint coastal towns. Everywhere they went, they lent a helping hand, spreading joy and laughter. In one town, they helped a baker, whose oven had broken down by breathing fire and baking all the bread. In another, they saved a kitten stuck up a tree with Billy sketching a soft landing pad and Sparky flying up to nudge the kitten down. Their actions weren't just acts of kindness. They were creating memories, building friendships and weaving tales of bravery that would be told and retold. Their bond deepened with each passing adventure, their friendship transcending the realms of the ordinary. Billy was so grateful for his magic pencil and his best friend Sparky. They knew their adventures were just beginning.